Hello YouTube, my name is Dragonheart the Prince of Wales and welcome to episode 9 of the Portugal campaign using the Portugal mod for Shogun 2. Right, so we beat the rebellion last time. We've sorted out our economy somewhat. We've still got an issue with food, but public order's now happy. If I was to leave with everything, public order would go right down. If I was to put a couple of the merchant crews back in, still not too happy look, even with them. Arcabusia, still not happy. Promoted Arcabusia in. Only now is it leveled. I've had to literally split my entire forces just to level that. So, that's the issue I got right now. I'm still, I'm still not too happy. And I can't really afford too much at the moment either. Money is not that good. Plus, my port is blockaded and I got nothing to sort of sort that out. So, yeah, bit of an issue right now, guys. I do have a navy. Ooh, hang on. <gasps> Training spot! I don't get anything. Seriously. So yeah, this is the other issue I go as well. My merchant caravel. Um, I get nothing from that. I've got the trading spot, but obviously my port... It's because my port's blockaded. So it's worth me holding on to it, but I just can't get any money unless they bugger off. So some issues, as you can see. Some little issues. Okay, so let's end turn. So, as long as they blockade my port, I'm trapped on my island, basically, guys. That is the other issue that I have. I don't have a navy. I just need to drop my troops off. Hopefully hold my own in battle, then. <laughs> They're just going to sit there for ages. Shimizu. Oh, okay, so the Shimizu have now adopted Christianity. Okay, you naughty dogs. Will you be friends with me now? You like my... Like the same god as us. Uh, Shimizu, Shimizu, Shimizu. Request peace. I would offer you 631 Koku. Plus, I'll give you access. That's a very good deal, but they're not going to take it. Uh, I'm, only, I'm over the Ashikaga Koganet as well, and again, they won't do anything with me. Even if I was to offer them uh, money, I offer you 631. So I can't do anything diplomatically. It's really annoying. Yuchi, can I, like, you offer you like access for something? No. Nope. Our land's worth nothing, you see. That's the other issue we have. Ah, Boozin. Shimmers are up there. Boozin. Bongo. Oh, they have Hyuga now as well. See, they've only got, they've only expanded as well. They're even stronger now. We literally picked the wrong person to go to war with. They should have picked Sagara. Look at that. Sagara, one settlement. Or Shoni. I think he's in would have been the best one. The Shoni. So yeah, I am thinking restarting the campaign would probably be beneficial. Uh, but I did say we're geared to episode 10, which is what we're doing, just to see if we can get out of this little wormhole that we're in. But unless they move here with these ships, I can't do anything uh, against them, basically. I don't think that Yuchi are interested in alliances, are they? I do not if I was to offer them everything but politics and offer them indefinite access, and yeah, it's not worth nothing. So, yeah, I'm stuck here at the moment. I can get more merchant crews. I'm going to get another merchant crew, only because they, they fought it, which I can leave in the settlement. I'm happy to leave all my merchant crew here if I bring all my guns with me. So to speak, four turns, I get the musketeers and the bombard. I get a bombard. Oh, it's going to be useful. Well, actually, what did I say then? The neighbor's building of a powder maker bombard. And he was recruitment and replenishment of Bombard. Right, we'll see how it goes. I can't do anything else. <laughs> Recruit one thing. We've checked all the diplomatic options. And then... The more will happen then to you guys. If you can't get out of this, then... Episode 10 will basically be like an overview of what we've done. Where I think I went wrong. And what I think I'll do in the next time. And obviously I'll, I'll take your comments on board as well. The thing is, they, they've got ships here. I've got no ships that can fight them. Like the only ship I can get is Merchant Caravel, which is just useless. They've got these other ships backing them up here. They've got the Hatakyama just taking the trading spot here. I've got the trading spot up here, but I can't do anything with it because I've, my trading port is taken. I can't offer them anything. Okay, if I was to leave now with all of these, public order should actually still be... Yeah, they're pretty happy now, see? I can leave Merchant... Actually, probably leave a couple of these... 
Yeah, I can actually leave probably two of them in there now. There we go, public order's good again. I was only one this time, but that's fine. And even with you on the on these, it's not going to work. That's the only ship I can bloody get. Oh, that being said, I could probably... Ah, but it's the thing, you see, if I get attacked at sea, I lose my whole army. Ah, oh, shit. It's probably worth bringing this ship back in that case. No point having the trading spot if you can't do anything with it. So if we bring the ship back... Hopefully we don't get caught up by enemy navies here. Possibly come around here. But I think you can only, you can only jump on at the port. Which I can't handle right now. Thing is, if I attack, that happens. Unless I incite a rebellion with awful tax rate. They destroy my port. And if my port's destroyed, then they might not... You know, that's actually a possibility. We've got the army to do it now as well. Right, okay, we're going to try it. Whack our right up. Oh, they love me, though. That's the problem I got. Whack that right up. Get out of the province. We're going to get a rebellion, and we're going to squash the rebellion. But we're going to let the rebellion destroy the port. In the hope. Yeah, that's actually it's so it's such a mad plan it might work because the rebellion could destroy the port. The AI would think then that the Shimizu would not have to blockade a destroyed port. And I can perhaps get my army on a ship after defeating the rebellion. Okay, we'll try that. This is one way out of it, maybe. Me and my mad ideas. Nice. Oh wow, and the Shimizu moving ships that way. Oh, they could give us a chance, maybe. I'm just going to drop the army off at the nearest piece of land. I don't care if it's an enemy faction or not. If I can. I'm just going to drop them off at the nearest piece of land. Probably be here. I believe that the ship... So I can't do it with this ship, but... Uh-oh. Uh Uh-oh. The thing is, now, Shimizu are on the way there. So I need to go up here, don't I? Go up in this direction, away from him. Get away from him. And then we'll go, we'll go up and around, basically. Go that way. I don't think you, no, I can't just uh, support there though. We go, yeah, we go for bloody. Uh, Shimizu, this is Shimizu anyway. Oh, they've taken. Oh, hang on. They've taken Takushi and he's in. Okay, so poor Sagara. Uh, well, Sagara allied with them. So they've taken basically everything now. The Shimizu. Yeah, Shoni used to own that and they've taken that as well. God, they're nasty, aren't they? Those Shimizu. Who do they think they are? Alright, I can get another Arkabus here. Two turns. It's worth it. It is most definitely worth it. I have so many guns. I might even fight them in the field. Uh, oh, actually, no, probably fighting them. No, can't fight them in the field. Cause I got guns to destroy that port. If I exempt them, oh, don't exempt them. Put on the money, see. So let it go like that for now. I'm thinking that if the AI destroys my port, they might not gang up on me like this. It's a stupid, stupid thing to think of, but it might actually work. That's why I say it's such a crazy thing it may work. Because if, if a port's destroyed, the AI might not block... Well, the AI won't blockade a destroyed port. Problem is I have no ships, but I only need one ship to transfer and not get attacked. Yeah, trade disrupted by Yuchi. Probably because they destroyed. A rebellion at Goto. Right. Rule the waves. Plus two morale for all ships. Lift the blockade upon the following port. Go to, I can't. <laughs> I literally can't. Can't destroy it. Yeah, the Uchi been destroyed as well. So much of being friends with them. Right. Grab you. Get back in there. They have a large stack army. It's pretty much similar to what they had. Oh, they got bows this time. Nice. We can sit here. We get our other Arkabusi on another turn. I get another merchant crew if I want. But I want them to destroy my port. Right, the ship that I've got. Do I risk going this way? I think I do. Movement point out of range. I'm trying to go, come from the north side, you see, to come down. If that affects anything or not. I'm going to be so annoyed if I lose my army in a naval battle, you see. And this guy, Sakasi Hiduki. Hiduki. Bit up against him in a moment. Oh my word, right. One last time, though. Let's try and get peace with him. See if we can get the bugger off. 
That is for Fred. I've got Speak nothing to piece. offer them. Even indefinite. Look at that. They got seven provinces. So it's not gonna happen, is it? Right, end turn. Rebellion, hopefully destroys my port, hopefully Shimizu fuck off. I oh, see they they move one ship away, they bring another one back. Just a perpetual um thing of back and forth. Right, we've got more troops this time as well. Another battle, they got two thousand, we got two thousand ninety. We'll fight this one. I'm gutted, they didn't destroy my port, did they? Bastards! Okay, if we can destroy them, if we can defeat the army but leave enough of them so that the rebellion isn't quashed, then maybe they'll destroy the port next time. Or will they destroy the port if the ship's there? Oh yeah, of course they will, because I think it was destroyed last time, wasn't it? But I had ships there. Oh, I don't know. I'm just hoping that this will work. This, basically, this is the episode to do it in. Episode 9. If I can't, then we'll have to restart if you guys want me to restart this campaign. Or if there's another faction you want me to see me play as. Or do you want to see me play as a faction um, with the Portugal mod installed? Okay, they're all coming from this side. We need to get our men up here. Okay, bows. You can go on the wall over there. Right, you can go there. Okay, they come from this side, so... You can go there. Mount the Dark Busia, get you along here. Uh, you can come along here a bit more. You're wasted there, I need to get you on this corner. Here, like that. Mitch and crew. Mitch crew take us so much room. It's ridiculous. Right, okay. I got my samurai radinas. I think I even used them last time. There's fire upon everything. They're gonna waste ammo doing this. Bow, matchlock, bow. And track to see it. I'm half tempted to get them out of the settlement. Problem is, I got too much stuff now. <laughs> I got too many troops. You guys, come here up here. Yari, yari, yari. Both out, both out. But oh, look at this. These shits, little shits that they are. Destroyed that. Little fuckers, right? Look at the cabinet there. They're just aiming to everything right now. They're wavering, but they. Right, you. Aim for those match locks and use fire. We're not quite in range yet, it's fine. They lose men on the walls, you see. That's what we're trying to do. 100 or 110. 63. 160, 160. We're going to lose them there, it's fine. Got Yari Ash got a waver on the walls by here. My bows are taking a bit of punishment though, right. Ah, we'll see it. Just shoot them. Just shoot them. Go on. Rapid volley fire, just fucking hit them. Let's get the samurai down there as well. Okay, merchant crew. You're gonna screen them and you're gonna be on skirmish. Matter of fact, all Arcabusi is skirmish mode. Okay, I can use this as cav. Probably best to do that. On the bows. You can shoot the shit out of them and then chase up at the cav and get around them with the cav that side. Uh, general, leave the general for now. Merchant crew. Right, merchant crew, dilly dally with them. Arcabusier, rapid volley, rank fire. And get into formation for me for fuck's sake. Send. Samurai retainers in there. You can do that there. I've got Yaris on the way in there. Bit of a mess right now. It's fine. Bring you up there. Get to the side, have I? 
think it's again shot on right now. Right, you know what? We're gonna shit on him. You can come out there like that. And you can just turn your attention now. You've done enough, you've done 112. Broken them actually. Broken both of them. Cav's gonna shit on him. Got more arquebus here. Too many guns, you see. <laughs> you can never have too many guns when you're playing as Portugal. Even the merchant crew is getting some kills. I mounted that uh, things there, right? I don't want to chase him off too far. Just get this one for now. Right, okay, the bows. Pull my bows to aim for their bow cav because they're going to be a pain in the fucking ass. They are. Okay, come back. Wait, right, come back around here now. Might even get a few of them, yeah. Get this Captain Major by you. Captain Major Bastard. Chasing me off. Right, Captain Major Bastard. Arkabus here. Shoot the shit out of him. Uh, I can nothing else here, have I? Merchant Cruise. Yeah, let's get the Merchant Cruise out. We got the general by here chasing us down. Okay, uh, bows. Chase them down. Arcabusier. Get on there, get on the wall. Another Arcabusier, get on by there. I want to use a fire upon that. Use some flames. Watch this for you now. We're gonna try something different. Dismount. They're fast, aren't they, Captain Major? Look how quickly they're running. My horses are blocking them. Wally! Fire, you assholes. Oh, shit. <laughs> My horse is just charging them. Right, all of you, get in and help out. Lose my mounted troops to do this. Okay, how am I doing on the other side? This is a bit of a clusterfuck over the side, to be honest with you. Some bow calf for you. Right, charging. Yardies for there. Just look at my arquebusiers firing down there. Stick you on the wall over there, because you can actually kill some of the yardies that are coming back over that bridge. Bit of a choke point. General. Get your ass out. What am I doing? Still got a lot of mounted troops left. I'm gonna pull back with you while my merchant crew is getting involved on the general. He's broken. Get the fuck out of there. Right, okay, that's good. What's left then? Oh, there we go. Uh I'm going to end the battle, because I want enough troops to be alive so that it, um, they can perhaps destroy the port. That's all I'm kind of gaming on now, is is the hope that them destroying that port will work out for me. Basically, I picked the wrong target at the start of this campaign. Oh, shit. Deploy 2000, lost 2000. Oh, bollocks. I didn't kill them all. I left loads of them alive, but unfortunately, they're all dead. Got bow expertise as well. Even with a high tax rate. I'm staying in the settlement. What if I was to destroy the port? Okay, we'll try plan B. And that's you getting down here. But even with that, if any ships around you, I'm done for. Because this navy's got nothing left. I might be able to get you there. Look at to get an army. It might be possible, you see, but then I'm I'm hoping more than anything. Didn't mean to do that, sorry. I might dismantle the port, though. One turn. This is very risky indeed. Right, try that. It's all I can do, just try and get them away from my bloody port. Okay, yeah, yeah look out. Look out, look out. Yeah, you see, it's the problem I got. I can't get any ships near them. Even by retreating. 
even by retreating. Oh god. Oh, have they just have they left the port? I think they have. Oh, bar one ship. They have basically blockaded that port by there. Again, I could have smart like and make another harbour, but it's not worth it, is it? Right, let's just try to get Oh, in the hope of trying to get something with them. Peace. I do not I'll offer you a thousand all my money. Indefinite access. Encounters. I'll ally myself, but no. I can't get anything with them. Uh, my ship. Where'd my ship go? Did I lose that ship? I think I did. I don't know where it went to. Retreated, and I think. Yeah, I high sea attrition. Yeah, I've only got the one ship left, and that's this one. Post roads and stations. This is the thing. Even with an auto resolve, I've only got one ship there. Oh, decisive victory. <gasps> there is a god after all. Holy shit. Yeah, but this is the risk we now have, you see. Oh, shit. Well. Gotta be into it. This is gonna be the last push, guys. Okay, this might be the last episode unless we restart. Apply back to normal. Everything. Everything except two of these. Go onto that ship. I don't care where we just bark. Where we embark by. I don't. I don't care. I don't care if it's Higo and Sagara. Don't care if it's flaming Satsuma. Just get me off the ship. Shimazu, he's in. Get me the bloody he's in. Shit. Yay! We've made land and I'm suffering attrition. <laughs> Finally, we got past them all. Right, need to rebuild this quickly. Harbour, I need a harbour. Uh, yeah, public order's fucked, hell. I need one to exempt that. Oh, I can't afford it though. Can I recruit another one of these merchant crews quickly? Because I haven't got the general anymore. Oh god, I'll have to exempt the next turn if it's going to be an issue. Make this a special length video, okay? Because we've actually landed the army at he's in. Oh, actually, no, I might. I'll save for episode 10, okay? So we, we've <laughs> we've got the army at Heezen. We might be able to try and do something with this. No, this campaign. Might be able to salvage something. Um, I'm going to end this very freaky episode here. I've been Dragonheart, the Prince of Wales. Thank you for watching. Until next time, goodbye.